everyone and welcome back to my channel if you are new here then i welcome you if you love watching handbag videos and a little bit of this and that then certainly hit the subscribe button but let's go ahead and jump into this video. So today, y'all, I wanted to come on really quickly and show y'all what I have in this bag before I move out of it. Um, I carry this bag, y'all, a week up until our family trip. And then during the trip, I did carry this bag one time, y'all, and I absolutely love this carry. I... <laughs> You know what, y'all? Every time I carry a bag and I fall in love with it, I want multiple. So this bag is no different. At this point, I do want multiple. <laughs> this is the Furla Recandy bag, y'all, in the color lemon. I did do a very in-depth video of on this bag, so I will leave that information in the description below, y'all. Yeah, this bag was just so awesome, y'all. Um, to carry on the trip which by the way y'all we had an amazing time like Orlando Florida do not owe us anything <laughs> we got to do so much y'all we did actually get to go to the beach we did go to Disney World the kids enjoyed themselves my husband and I we enjoyed ourselves and we're just so happy that we were able to spend that time together and now we're back home safe and sound <laughs> So, firstly, y'all, to take y'all around this bag, with me carrying it, yes, I did actually get some marks and things on it. So, um, I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but I do have a little spot here, which I'm hoping if I wipe it down, then it's going to be fine. And... Basically, I just need to do a wipe down of this bag all over, because there are some marks in certain spots. And again, I'm not too sure if the camera is going to pick it up. The awesome thing is, if I wipe it down, I think everything will come off. So here is the bottom. Feet and everything still looks good. Oh, yes, and I love this bag, y'all. I got so many compliments on this bag, too. Everyone loved it, and it was so awesome because sometimes I would carry it this way um not on purpose but even with me doing so people still commented on the bag and said how much they love the furla bag not even seeing the furla name on it but just knowing that furla is known for their bags like this so yeah it was pretty awesome to know but to get into it y'all i do have my sanitizer hanging from the bag and this is in the uh sent among the clouds y'all among the clouds is like my favorite right now from bath and body works i am just loving this smell so so much um this is almost done for so i'll have to actually buy more of those more of the sanitizer but let's get inside and that's another thing y'all this chunky zipper i love this chunky zipper it is just awesome like oh they did such a great job so at a glance, this is how my bag is looking, y'all. So I was able to keep everything all nice and organized. Okay, so the first thing that I have in here is my receipt. It's actually a coach receipt. So while I was in Orlando, I did actually go to a coach store. And then I also, y'all, pause real quick but I also was actually able to go into a Dooney and Berg store y'all and it was the most amazing experience ever like you would have thought that like that was the last handbag store on earth I felt like a groupie y'all <laughs> I was just so emotional and, and like my emotions are all over the place because I couldn't believe that I was in the Dooney and Burt store as soon as I walked in y'all I just inhaled and it smelled like my closet Oh, the leather smell. I just love it. So this is a composition book that I had in here. Um, but yeah, y'all, it was a great experience. And of course, I have now added more Dooney and Burt to my list. <laughs> so um, here is my six ring key holder from Louis Vuitton. And it is holding all of my keys, including my key fob. So my key fob is actually able to fit in there nicely. And y'all, I had so much fun accessorizing this bag. So I can't wait to show y'all the accessories that I use. Um, but I did have my iWalk charger in here as well. I did have to use this a few times while we were at the park. And it did give me about a 50% charge, which was 
just fine for me. Okay, and then like I said, y'all, I'm on the clouds. I'm loving it. So I do have the fragrance mist here in my bag. So then next up, y'all, I did have my Mario Badesco skincare facial spray. This definitely came in handy, y'all. It was so hot in Florida. So just spraying this on really, like, refreshed me. Like, I felt refreshed. I love it. And I do like to carry that in my bags in the uh, warmer months. Next up, I have my little famous coach pouch. And I am using this pouch to hold my planets because that's what this pouch is now going to be used for have my toilet tissue my Lysol I have my among the clouds body cream oh, I love it I just love the stuff y'all <laughs> I just love it okay and so then I have my manicure set think positive and I think that's all the loose items I had in here yeah what is this another receipt and then our little Disney card okay so then moving on to the fun accessories. So this is the very first one, y'all. So I cannot remember where I picked this pouch up at. I think it may have been TJ Maxx. It came in a set. So this is like a purple a clear pouch. And this I'm using as my little first aid, first aid kit. So have all my little first aid items in there that I need. I did have a toilet seat cover in here, but we did use that. So that is no longer in the bag. I have to put another one in there. And then for my wallet, y'all, I use this here. This I did pick up from Marshalls on last year. Such an amazing piece because it is a multicolored wallet. So of course, it's gonna go with so many of my bags. I'm purse happy too. She recently showed this on her channel too. So she was able to get one of these here too. And I think my sister DJ King has one. Um, Carmen Hawkins, Dunia at 615. There's a plethora of us that have this little wallet. <laughs> so I love it. It is so nice. And then the last thing that I have, is this the last thing? I have some trash down in here. So yeah. That is pretty much everything that I had in this bag, y'all. So this bag right here was here was actually acting as my catch-all slash makeup bag. So I'll just give you all a peek because I pretty much have all of my same old same old in the bag. I did actually wear my Marc Jacobs Daisy Love the whole time on the trip. This is some really, really good stuff, y'all. I love it. Really nice. Uh, spring scent and then y'all already know I have the among the clouds hand cream in there high to go oh yes I forgot about this so this y'all was actually gifted to me by Carmen Hawkins and this is a cute little ink pen. I thought that it went really well with my Among the Clouds item. So I definitely had to throw this pen into the bag. And I enjoyed writing with it. Kyra also <laughs> enjoyed writing with it. Um, I have this little lip balm here. Here is my Coach Mirror. Um, this is a NARS lippy, and this is actually in the color Katie. And it's really pretty, it's a really nice shade, but I don't think I wore that on the trip the whole time. I have my Tarte Light Karma Lashes Mascara, and I'm actually gonna leave this out. I'm probably gonna throw it away because I did not like it. I cannot tell a difference when I put that on, so yeah have a brow setter my OPI nail glue that came in handy for me <laughs> more little knickknack stuff I 
have my safety tool and then this is a new lippy y'all that i picked up during ulta's 21 days of beauty it is by the brand urban decay and it is in the color gridlock matte 50 w 900 yeah so it's really pretty too it's a really pretty shade i like it so yeah, y'all, that is pretty much everything that I had in this little pouch here. This pouch I did get as a free gift one year from Lacombe. And yeah, I love it so, so much. All right, y'all, so that is that. That completes this video. I do hope that you all enjoyed it. If you did, then certainly give it a thumbs up. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.